I'm Panoplosaurus. That's pan o plo -saurus. I wonder if you can guess what my name means. Welcome to our game show. Guess the meaning of my name. Clue number one. I live here in the late Cretaceous period, 74 million years ago. No guesses? Okay. I'm from the family of dinos called Ankylosauria. That means I have body armor. I have a stiff, clubless tail. And look at all my spikes. I'm built like an armored truck. Any ideas? Uh, square root of four. Uh, uh, divide by eight. Mm, pie. This is an easy clue. I'm the same size as a dump truck. And I weigh three and a half metric tons. The same as an elephant. Of course, all of this armor is to protect me from meat eaters like these two T-Rexes. Okay, this is the last clue, and then you'll have to answer. I live in what is now Alberta, Canada. So can you guess what my name means? Does it mean delicious? No, Panoplosaurus means totally armored lizard. Look at all the armor on me. Sheesh. Do I win something? No. Hey, play nice. I gave you easy clues. Oh well, see you next time. Ladies, we're never going to eat if you two keep scaring off the insects. Sorry, Sorry that, that was, was my bad. bad. Hiya, I'm Saltopus. That's pronounced saltopus. It means hopping foot. I'm Vera. I'm Betty. We're very early theropods. That's meat eaters that walk on their two back legs. Now, girls, now! Okay, this isn't funny. Uh... <sighs> Welcome to the early Triassic period. 223 million years ago. We're from what is now called Scotland. But not much is known about us other than... We're dinos! Well, actually, they don't know for sure. So, if nobody knows what we really look like, then you might have purple polka dots and a yellow head. <laughs> or she might have horns and two tails. <laughs> Well, I think we to look a little like other dinos. We are about the same size as a cat, but with lots and lots of really sharp teeth. Oh, I don't know. I kind of like what I look like right now. They're mine! Very, very quiet. I'm on the hunt. Or am I being hunted? I'm Nick Webasaurus. That's Nick Webasaurus. The first dino ever to have a tongue click in his name. <laughs> Hurry, we must keep going. I'm being followed. I may not be big, but I'll have you know I am the great uncle to the powerful and famous T-Rex. In 50 million years, T-Rex will be crowned king of the dinosaurs. And he'll have me to thank. Dinos like me have been found in what is now known as Africa. Though I'm not as large as a T-Rex, I'm still all carnivore. <laughs> I eat insects and small lizards. My hands help me a lot because though I have only three fingers, one is like a thumb, making grabbing much easier. And these claws, razor sharp. They help me climb when there are no branches. My talents are hiding and sneaking around. I am super duper at being quiet and well, invisible really. But sometimes, ah! 
<laughs> We're also very, very jumpy. Hey! <laughs> <laughs> Those guys make me laugh. Hello, hello! I'm Nothronicus. That's Nothrone I Cuss. And welcome to our late Cretaceous TV show. No, your dinosaurs! Joining me today are my best buddies, Custard and Ronnie. Hi! Hi. We're talking about what makes us really different from other dinos. Custard? Any thoughts? Um, we're on TV? Uh, good try, uh, but no. Even though we're theropods, we don't eat meat. You see, most theropods are carnivores. Great, now I'm hungry. Oh, oh, I've got one. We have very fine feathers covering our whole bodies. Mm-hmm. What else is different about us from most dinos? We have these long claws for snipping leaves and branches. And our teeth aren't sharp, but they're perfect for mashing up plants. And we drool when we chew with our mouths open. I'm not drooling. Let's not forget that we need to eat a lot because we're really big. As big as this giraffe fella here. All right, all right, thanks for coming on the show. We live in what is now called New Mexico. And that's our show! Join us next time in the late Cretaceous period as we discuss asteroids, real or are they a myth? So, who wants to get something to eat? Wow! Hey! Hi, welcome to the late Jurassic period 150 million years ago. I'm Othnelia. You say that Oth, Ni, Li, Ya. <laughs> and I'm in the best game of tag I've ever played. Hey, hey, he's right behind us. Nah, he'll never tag us. We're way too fast. I mean, look at me. I'm built for speed. My stiff tail gives me balance to make super sharp turns. You can't tag me. Come here, you little herbivore. I'm not playing. I need to tell you something. <laughs> yeah, right. Why are you chasing me if you're not playing? He's right about me being a herbivore. That's a plant eater. But I'm not that little. I'm about the same size as a big dog. But with my tail, I'm much, much longer. Sorry, Al. You'll have to be quicker than that to tag me. I have lots of room to run around here in what's now known as Wyoming, USA. Come back here. I, uh, I just need to tell you something. Hey! Why'd you stop? Okay, fine. What did you want to tell me? Well, it's very serious. It's very, very serious. Tag. You're it. Nah. <sighs> I can't believe I fell for that. Ready or not, here I come. <laughs> Coming through. <laughs> Ooh. Well, hello there. I'm Sinosopterex. That's Sinosopterex. It means Chinese lizard wing. On account of the fact that I'm from China. And I am one of the first bird-like dinosaurs from 130 million years ago. My arms, ta-da, are covered with the neat little feathers. Whoa! Oh, but I can't fly. The feathers are just there to keep me warm. However, I can run really, really fast with my powerful legs. Hey, what are you doing? It's super cool. All you have to do is tuck and you slide all the way down. Eh, it's awfully far down. And though I may not be very big, I'm all carnivore. Mmm, meat. Come on, let's go. Uh, 
Um, uh, then, then, don't rush! Me! Oops! <laughs> oh well, I have the longest tail of any theropod dino. Sometimes, it gets in the way. Cool! Yeah! Well, it's my turn now! See you later! Woo-hoo-hoo-hoo! <laughs>